Mmm, yes, I like that sound. Right, where's the beef? Um, in my stuff. Oh, okay. That's Tasha, that's Steph. Let's go ahead and fill in the rest. We're gonna eat a little, drink a little. Our story time is the best. Have you LOL when you click play? No, this ain't no click back. What's up, y'all? Hey, guys, it's Steph. And Tasha, and we are back with another video. Today's video is a special video. This is the Members Choice video. Right? That's a good way to describe uh, okay. it. Members Choice video. <laughs> All right, so uh, tell them what we're doing here today, baby. Today, you guys, we are doing a hot pot. Yes. Again. Highly but, requested. But this time, we made our own homemade base, y'all. This is our first time doing our own base. So we'll okay. talk about all that when we get into the video and tell you what things we got to put in the hot pot as well. Yeah. We got a few viewer topics. I have a couple of viewer topics here. Okay. You ready? Yes. Then let's get into the video. All right, guys, we're back. So as we said before, we made our hot pot homemade this time. So what we have in our base is garlic, ginger, onion. We have some Chinese wine. Chicken broth, bay leaves, soy sauce, cloves, salt. This recipe called for star anise, but we don't like it, so we didn't put that in there. And I have a secret ingredient, some lime, that mm. made it taste really good, y'all. Now, but wine, you guys, is called Xiaoxing. Uh-oh. Xiaoxing. Xiaoxing. Okay. Uh, I've been trying not to take this off because it's so hot, y'all. What do we do at the top? <laughs> Wait a minute. Okay. I'm going to so move here this. We go, you guys. Woo. Oh, sorry. Woo. Move this on top of... It's hot. I'm gonna turn this up so it can boil. We already had it boiling on the stove top for probably like an hour, y'all. So yeah. the flavors are really developed pretty well. And it's hot. So I'm pretty, I think we can start adding some stuff. Okay. I'm gonna put a little more ginger in here and some garlic. We got green onion. Mm. How was the hot? Because we do have some chili peppers. It's not spicy. Uh oh. Uh oh. Well, uh -oh. well, let me put that on Tasha's side, y'all. Because. I love it hot. Here you go. That's love hot it hot. Side. Thank you. It's, I want to swim I over there anyway. I don't need no more hot on my side, y'all. I love it hot, y'all. I'm going to put a little, um, is this on? Cilantro on my oh, side. No. Oh, yeah. You can turn it on. So we gonna have, we have some food to grill as well. Here, we have salmon. We have wagyu beef. Mm -hmm. We have a couple of, a few scallops. And we have a flu, few doo-doo clear oh. shrimp. <laughs> okay. I got that out. And then we got my baby's favorite, bok choy. Yes. We have my favorite, the Napa cabbage, tofu, carrots, the enoki, enoki, enoki. enoki. Mm -hmm. mushrooms. Yes. Uh, what else we got? We got some ramen, a little bit of ramen. This is shin ramen, my favorite. We got some olive oil here for the barbecue. Mm -hmm. A little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. I have, um, I also have some rice on the side. We're going to bring a, a lot of other things in once we get this clear. Yeah. With the cooking. We have some sauces that we made all homemade. We'll talk about those when we it's get to dipping. So good, y'all. I think we can start adding stuff. Uh, oh, let's put the carrots for sure in here first. Yeah. Okay. Let the carrots start. And we also have a few topics, y'all. I, I actually, um, it's, it's, it's three topics. Two of them are from little kids. I know we don't do a lot of little kid topics too much, but um, I saw a couple little kids, you know, I'm like, okay, let me tell them something. Okay. You know. I like bok choy, however, so I'm going to go ahead and throw my bok choy in. It can be wilted as ever. I love it. Ooh. This is tofu, you guys. The, um, what is it called? Tofu cutlet. I yeah. love that. I eat that by itself, y'all. Somebody be eat that thing in the morning. <laughs> Like it's got a lot of protein. I wish I liked the flavor, but well, I, yeah, it doesn't have a flavor. Yeah. <laughs> I wish I liked it. Doesn't it. Dip. All right, y'all. So here we go. We've had so many people ask us to do hot pot, y'all, and yes. we want it. Stephanie, I think, especially loves hot pot. I love hot pot. I like it too, but she loves it, and it's just so hot, y'all. So, so you know, we doing pretty good today, though, because today is not a real hot day. And then we also learn how to fix our camera a little better, so we don't have to have the lights so bright. That's true. And we made the broth before the stove yeah so so we didn't have to wait so long exactly to be so hot i'm feeling pretty good right are you yeah good? i'm good i'm not okay. hot at all all right but stephanie did prepare all this so uh yeah she's when she said we she meant her so tasha's gonna start making some of the meats you guys what would you like my dear you know what i want i want that wagyu she want that long meat <laughs> mm -hmm. mm, yes i like that sound Put a piece of salmon on here too. Now the salmon is so, so good to me on here. I don't know why. 
because it just is. It's just delicious. Put some more. More salmon. Maybe a scallop. The scallop is going to take probably a little longer. Oh, man. Some of the oil. This is really fun to me. I hope we do this one day with our friends. That was shrimp. Yeah. And then we also have some salt and pepper on the side, y'all. Yes. Mm -hmm. do that. <laughs> okay. All right. Lemon for our seafood. I'm about to put some of my napple cabbage in here, y'all. The cabbage cooks pretty fast, so. Is this on high? The boil? Yeah. Yeah, everything is on high. Okay. Mm -hmm. This piece. I'm gonna take this piece off, y'all. This is actually cool, too. Okay. okay. So, uh, throw me one in the um, raw. A raw one? Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Be careful with y'all meat because it cooks so fast. Yeah. I can do, I'll throw a shrimp on my side, too. So, let me tell y'all about our sauces we have. So I, I have the sauce that we normally make that Tasha loves, the Thai chili seafood yes. sauce. And that's uh, Thai chili pepper, lime, garlic. We use monk fruit instead of sugar, fish sauce, and ponzu in that sauce. So Tasha, with the sauce that Tasha's going to be eating, that's that. Okay. Now I made two different so new sauces, you guys. This one was just like a basic hot pot sauce that I found. Soy sauce, rice vinegar, water, sesame oil, chili oil, green onion, and cilantro. That's this one. I've already tasted it. It tastes bomb. Okay. Oh, it yes. looks pretty similar to yours, but it tastes different though, y'all. Yeah. Okay, and then I had to try tahini sauce, y'all, because I keep seeing people. Do we put all the meat it. in here? Yeah, you can put it in there. Um, okay, so this is the tahini, tahini sauce. This is like kind of like peanut butter sauce, but it's not sweet like peanut butter, y'all. It's sesame paste. So it does have the same feel though. So it's tahini, which is sesame paste. Rice, vinegar, ginger, garlic, salt, sesame oil, green onion, and cilantro. I like it. As I was making it, I was like, I don't know. I haven't tried it yet, y'all. After I was done and all the flavors came together, I actually really like it. So I'm about to try this, y'all. You know, I was gonna taste this meat. Oh shit! Oh, uh -huh. yeah. You do that meat? <laughs> hmm. I need some napkin. It's good. I think I would probably want y'all some rice. Oh shoot! It's hot, y'all. Let me take this out. I think my shrimp is probably ready too. Whoa! Oh, wait a minute. Let me use some other equipment, y'all. Oh here. We go. I hope this shrimp is ready. Looks like it is. That's shrimp. Oh, it's not ready. cut. How do you know it's deep boo? No, I didn't cut it. I thought you didn't want to cut. No, I I pulled them out. Oh, okay. All right, I'm going to try my new hot pot sauce here, too. Let's see how this is safe. Mm. Ah, ow! Mm. Bite! Mm. Mm -hmm. That's mine. I know Tasha wanted um, ramen. Matter of fact, let me put ramen in here now. You think the scallop is ready? That one could be. Just open it. Yeah, this looks good. This is like just ready. If you okay. like yours like well, well done, you want to leave it on, but I like it like this. That's cool. Personally. Here. Because that makes things taste good. The lemon. Did you add salt? Oh. This is, this is, this be so much going on, y'all. So much. I want to <laughs> get my stuff out, finish cooking. This is a lot. This already 16 minutes in. Okay. No, this, they, these, these are normally wrapped really, really long. Okay. So you got to cook. So I'm going to put some rice in my bowl. I hope y'all can see. Um, I don't know where my food is. This, <laughs> your food swims away. Put some wagyu right here. And then as much as you want to eat it right when you put it in your bowl, don't do that. Don't do that, y'all. Hot. I have burned my tongue so many times. Being green. Whew. 
Also has some Thai, um, no, this is garlic. What is this called? Garlic chili bag? Chili. Yeah, okay. I love this on rice. I love it. All right. Lipstick all over my hands. I was hungry, y'all. All right, y'all. I'm gonna take my noodles out. Ow! This is not a joke. This stuff is hot. Oh, it's I'm still hot. Choi, bok choi. My favorite. I'm just gonna throw the salmon on here, you guys, because. Need it to cook. Mm. Mm -hmm. Woo. Hot. Woo. My stuff been sitting in this bowl for five minutes and it's still hot. It's still hot. <laughs> Do another wagyu. Oh, oh, look, look, that's on my side. Mm. Mm -hmm. Throw another one in there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think we should throw that other um, base in. Alright, I'm going to pour the rest of this base, y'all. Y'all see it's getting low. All this stuff. This gook. It's good gook. Throw it in there. As I'm cooking, I'm just going to go ahead with the top. I'll, I'll uh, keep cooking so you can do some. Ooh, this scallop look bomb, y'all. Look at that. Oh yes. All right, so I'm just gonna go. I got three topics up here. I'm in seventh grade and my best friend came out to me saying she is bi. I didn't think anything of it until she came over to my house. I'm not against it, but it kind of creeped me out when I said, let's go swimming. And she said, at night, let's go skinny dipping. <laughs> I laughed and said, no, I don't. I laughed and said, no. I don't know what to do and I don't want to be friends anymore. Because every time we argue, she makes everything about her. And I love you guys so much. <laughs> we love you too. So, I mean, you pretty much already said what you want to do is not be her friend. Yeah. So don't be it. Yeah. If you don't want to be her friend, if you're not comfortable, don't be her friend. Yeah. I don't think there's anything wrong with you not wanting to be her friend. Not because she's bi, but because she kind of is taking it too far with you. Mm -hmm. You know, just because you are you like girls doesn't mean you're supposed to like your friends mm -hmm. you know you got to give them that personal you know you can't make somebody uncomfortable you know that's not cool but you don't have to tell her anything if you don't want to be her friend just I, hey I, I just i can't be friends with you mm -hmm. she she crossed the line and that's it i will say this as a young person we probably all have liked Sorry. one of our friends you know what I'm saying? Because we really don't get out a lot. I mean, the people that you know and hang around with are pretty much the only people that you meet. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. When you're young. Yeah. So I think a lot of people have liked their friends when they're young. So I do think that's a common thing. Now, if you have, if you did want to be a friend, I would say talk to her and let her know I'm not into girls and I don't want you to flirt with me. You Ever. know what I'm saying? Period. And then if, the, if she doesn't continue to respect you, then don't be a friend. You know, that's what I would say. But if you just over it already, bye. And she also said every time they argue, she always makes it about her. Yeah, so, so there's other issues. Basically. I mean, yeah. That's, in seventh grade, I guess some people argue, friends argue. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, hey, you're not going to remain friends with everybody. Right. Some people grow apart. I need to eat my food. Right. I don't need it, baby. Because <laughs> I love this salmon. Mmm. Mm -mm. I ain't even using the right thing. Oh my goodness. I'm getting hot down, you guys. Right. Where's the beef? Um. In my stuff. Oh, okay. Wait, there's some inside of here. I didn't really think you cared about this. So I was not really trying to save it. Oh, shit. Mm -hmm. There's some somewhere in here that we never got out. This ramen is so hot. You want to play with it? I'll take this. Hard for me to pick this up. Static. Mmm, my finger is burning. I know. Two pieces of beef in here that I've never got out. There's one. Mm, 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 mm. Oh my. That is so good. 
I'm, I love this so mm. good. Mm. 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 Work around this time. There's one more topic, y'all, but I ain't eat. Mm. I can read it. Get some more salmon and this lime. My goodness. All right, y'all. Y'all just don't know. Wait, I got to want to watch that eat. Mm. I need to dip this. This bok choy. Everything in this. Mm. Third topic, y'all. I'm 23 years old and currently pregnant by my boyfriend who's 36. He already has six kids by the same mother. I also have a four-year-old daughter. Me and him have been together for a year. At first, we didn't have any issues. Then, became the baby mama and her mess. Okay, so I think then came the baby mama and her mess. Yeah. Calling, texting me. He has custody of all six kids. Wow. Because she's on drugs. Me and his, my child's father are cordial. We don't have any issues. I know I'm young, but how much of the mess am I supposed to put up with? My first question, that's my first question. Second question is, he has a 12 year old daughter. She's not really his, but he was married to the mom. The mom cheated and that's how she got here. Wow. The 12 year old is rude and disrespectful. I do everything I can for all of the children because my mother was also on drugs and I want them to see that it's more out here than what they've already seen. Not only does she disrespect me, she disrespects him as well. Mm. Right now, she is with her real dad. And she calls my boyfriend when she needs money. So she calls him by his real name, not even dad. She sneaks out of the house at 2 a.m. to meet up with boys. She's really fast, and she is 12 years old, dating people almost 20. I mean, you 20, 20 and 36, you know what I mean? Okay. Um, she sends news to boys having sex. Am I wrong for not wanting to have my daughter around her? I know I'm young, but I know what and how my kids, how I want my kids to be. Okay. No, you're not wrong for not wanting your kid around her because I wouldn't want mine around her. Okay. Absolutely not. I wouldn't either, to be honest. Hell no. First of all, 12 year olds don't need to be dating. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And second of all, period. I don't give a damn how old the person is they dating. I don't even want to say that, but I'm saying that ain't even his daughter. And it's not like, oh, he raised her. That's not his daughter. And but she he's the only dad she has. She actually has a father. Right. So it's not like she she's basically using him. Her dad probably be like, hey, call this dude to get what I mean, she's not exactly. I don't know if she's using him for sure, but yeah, maybe. If you're saying that she's only calling for money and that's really why she's calling, then it's not hard for a kid, especially a kid like that. She obviously got some issues exactly. to be a user. A young lady, her boyfriend is a good guy because he doesn't oh, yeah. want to. First of all, he has custody of all three kids. He doesn't want to let go of the daughter that's not his because he feels he probably loves her. Yeah, you and then I mean? those are his children's siblings. Right. That's right. That's the hard one right there. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I wouldn't want my kids to be around her either. No. But I would be annoyed that he was doing all this stuff. And she's disrespectful. But what if it was his, his real daughter? He would still have to deal with it. So it's exactly. the same thing. Yeah, it is. Because he basically feels like that's his daughter. Yeah, that's exactly. why he's doing it. Right. You know? So I don't know. Um, That is hard. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. So hard. But mm -hmm. this meat? Man. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm-mm-mm. I can't even tell you what to do though. You know, you're not trying to leave somebody that you love and you have a good relationship with. Yep. Because their daughter is um, messed up, but that is going to be a part of your life for the rest of your life. So you kind of have to make a decision based on that. I think you should talk to him. I don't know what y'all gonna say because y'all can't y'all can't control that that girl. Because number one, she don't even live with y'all. Exactly. So y'all can't control her at all. I mean, I definitely wouldn't be letting her disrespect nobody. First mm -hmm. of all, we need to talk about that. But as far as him wanting to take care of her, that's his daughter. That's how I look at it. 
And if he wants to do that, let him do it. You can't stop somebody and you shouldn't. Yeah. Thank God she don't live with y'all. <laughs> Be happy yeah. about that. <laughs> but she say. runs away, she comes over. So she obviously comes over and does all these things. So y'all only got to deal with it a few days a week. I'm scared of bombs. Or however often y'all got to deal with it, I don't know. But um, she wouldn't be coming up in my house. I'll be in this We nope. got to fix that. Mm -hmm. That's what we got to fix. Yeah. Now, mm -hmm. her first question was something too. She had two questions. Mm -hmm. I don't know. All right, let me look. Oh, this is good. But so the good. sweat is real. Mm -hmm. It's kicking in now, y'all. Mm, 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 mm. The baby mama drama, basically. She's mm. saying, how long should she deal? I mean, should mm. she have to deal with that? She doesn't say what the issues are. And I think that's it's kind of hard to answer what you should do. She's uh, just saying there's baby mama drama. Oh, the lady's on drugs. So who knows mm. what she doing? Well, I'm thinking, you know she on drugs and he got custody of all the kids. That shit is annoying, though. Know? It is She's annoying. Coming around, being drugged out. Who knows? And there's something you gonna have to deal with because you you have a, you have a kid with him. Yeah. So, yep. As long as he's raising his children, y'all got a lot of kids. Mm -hmm. So, seven kids, eight. It must be eight once she has uh, nine. He had six. She had one. Mm -hmm. And then they about to have another one. And then the twelve year old. Oh, I thought that was included. That's not included in the six. Oh my god. No, cause she lives with the dad. She said he got custody of six. Oh. And there's wow. another one. Oh. Eight kids. Excuse me, y'all. That's a lot of kids. Mm. That's a lot of chillin'. It's hard. I'm just gonna eat this tofu. Girl, more power to you. Did you, you drink? This, did you cook any of this tofu? Mm-hmm. Oh, is it in here? Yeah. Yeah. All, everything on here? Cook. Nah, not on there. Oh. Let's try it. Oh, that beef was amazing. The scallops Ooh. bomb as heck. Ooh. Oh, the scallops. the scallops. Wow. Uh, I think the scallops was my favorite. And that was the one wow. we had the least of, y'all. Exactly. I didn't think I was going to want that. Me neither. Well, I knew I was going to want some, but I didn't think I was going to want that many. See this? Last I seen that little piece you got there. I should have <laughs> eaten it. But you Ooh. made this whole thing. I don't oh, even like so this, y'all, but I want some more lime. So, damn. I'm going to go ahead and just eat it. Mm. Mm. Oh, no. Uh uh. Mm hmm. Mm mm mm. 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 For the sake of video, I'm not gonna spit it out. Mm. This is so good. Mm -hmm. So, what do you think of the base? It was good. Are you happy with it? The base tastes um really good, y'all. It had like a miso. It tastes like miso flavor, kind of garlicky. I mean, ginger. It wasn't sweet. It was good. Yes, yeah, I like it. I like it too. To me, I have not liked. Any of the package sauces that we tried, mm -hmm. we've tried what four or five of them. Mm -hmm. If I could drink this, I would. I mean, I can. <laughs> I want to. Are these bubble fields? I didn't check. So they might be. I've cleaned like I think four or five of them out. So yeah, that one might be fine. That one would probably. Look it. I wanted the shrimp, but I was scared they was all bubble fields. Uh, I'm sorry, I didn't do it right there. I should have fixed them so we could uh, do the thing that we normally do. I wasted this shrimp. This is going back in the freezer. It's gonna get cleaned and put in the refrigerator. Mm hmm. Hell yeah. Woo! What time are we at? We 13. Done. I'm done. I'm done with this. It's hot. We did our video. I'm ready to take the shirt off. I'm sweating from the inside out. I mean, everywhere. I got sweat. Look at this. Look, have you ever seen me sweat like that? Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm beating sweat on my chest. Ooh. I'm like Whitney Houston's nose. Whoa. Okay, I'm hot hot. Thank you guys for suggesting this. We were happy to do it. Probably won't be doing it again anytime soon, but we did enjoy it. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Let us know what you guys think. We got a vlog channel, stuff that's on vlogs. Link is in the description below. Set your notifications to all if you want to be reminded of daily uploads, live streams, premieres. Until next time, only your lives. Peace.